Welcome to another episode of Ask a Psych Nurse. I'm Dustin, back for a, another a topic that is very important to my heart. Um, right now, it seems like everywhere you turn, you're hearing about the coronavirus. There is hysteria ever, everywhere. And as human beings, that's scary. It scares me that this virus is spreading so rapidly throughout the world. And around every corner, you hear about it. But as mental health professionals, we need to be very mindful about our discussions and what we're exposing our patients to in this time of media hysteria about the coronavirus. Many of our patients suffer from OCD, paranoia, and just extreme anxiety. To be bombarded by something that seems this apocalyptic is more than they can handle. They every day sometimes at times feel like they're being exposed to germs that could kill them or um, conspiracies that could take them out and in the world. We have to stop the fear and we have to provide support to our patients. The way we do that is first of all to realize that we're humans and we're vulnerable and we have our own fears. And to talk about those fears in an environment away from patient care. To not be discussing with our peers at work the, the death toll that has gone on with the coronavirus. Or be mindful on our units if a television is showing a news feed that is promoting and talking about all the latest statistics and, and the, the quick, quick, quickening spread of this virus, we need to turn it to something else. We need to give our patients distractions. At this point in time, we're gonna provide, of course, a virus-free environment. We're gonna be mindful and sanitize our hands and do all those things, but our patients are there to get mental health help. We cannot be exposing them to worries that are beyond um, what they should be focusing on. We need to teach them coping skills. We need to provide them support. We need to give them hope, not an environment of fear, but an environment of hope and safety. And we can do this by going through the mindfulness techniques that we all do every day to you know just listen to our patients hear what they need but turn away conversations of fear towards this hysteria and turn it back towards how are we going to get you to where you can maximize your mental health outcomes and provide a joyful and fulfilling life that being said, I would like to tell all my professional friends out there and anybody else that's listening, be strong, be brave, be courageous, and don't forget to view life through the joyful perspective. Have a great day. Thanks for tuning in.